Hi, in this video I will talk about this interesting article about how religious delusions impact patients with schizophrenia. Schizophrenia is a complex and chronic psychotic disorder characterized by a variety of positive symptoms including delusions, disordered thinking, and hallucinations. So they may have different them such as religious, grandiose, or persecutory. And religious delusion is they believe like they're God and grandiose is also it's also uh, grandiose and also religious delusion. So uh, and also persecutory uh, delusions are like uh, someone you believe that someone is interested in someone try to hurt you or someone try to follow you. The consequences of religious delusions and how mental health professions <coughs> tackle them can profoundly affect the results of psychotherapy and pharmacotherapy. Furthermore, religious, delusion, religious delusions may affect a patient's adherence to antipsychotic treatment. For example, they, can, they may claim that they don't need medication and they can uh, uh, live with this. So that's why the clinicians should know about uh, their uh, delusions. And also, it's important to know that religion actually impacts uh, make can improve their life, improve people's life. It can make them peaceful and happy. And however, however, in this disorder, we see that the delusions is not really like uh, hurting them. This is hurting them, but this is not like the religion is hurting them. It's like uh, the way that they deal with the stress is hurting them so if they don't use the religion they will use other methods like grandiose or persecutory so this is not about the uh, it's, it's actually they choose this this i think it, it to help them to cope with the stress because if they are someone important then they can cope with the stress very easily and if they're not uh, that important they can uh, they cannot uh, take they cannot uh, endure the stress so that's why I find this important. So, and yeah, anyway, the moderately believing in religion and meditating and thinking about God um, proved to be useful for mental health. Like we can see the literature, like meditation is a factor. And once this such meditation is, um, uh, is like a, a not religious one, and then people don't follow it that very often. But if it's uh, like a re about the religion, related to religion, people more likely, people they're more interested into uh, pursue this, and this is more meaningful because there's a meaning of meditation. It's not only for improving themselves; it's also for form of praying. So this is my opinion. Anyway, thanks for watching this video, and hope to see you in the next video.